Up is underway after severe weather rips through the coast last night. Parker Boyd shows us how that process is going. Past Christian Harbor master Russell Holloman watches a worker clear sand from his pier after a severe rainstorm Monday night. The water came in quick and it went out quick. Holloman says that rainstorm sent Mississippi sound waves crashing over several of the past harbor piers, scattering sand all over the parking lot. He says he was concerned for his friends who keep several boats moored in harbor slips. Yeah, I just hope that all the boat owners tied up their boats uh, good and and we were lucky enough that they did. He also says the wind was so strong that it knocked the boat off its trailer. Not much you could do at that point. We did have a good surge with the water. Harrison County Sand Beach crews on a mission to clear the beach of debris left by Monday's storm. Here in Gulfport, they were still dealing with strong winds. The group superintendent, Dennis Dockhand, says sand is now the main concern. If we could just get this wind to stop, because once this sand starts drying up, that wind's going to start blowing this sand up on towards the Highway 90. You can see how that is already happening. The sand is making its way across Highway 90. Monday night storm brought 25 to 35 mile per hour winds. And Holloman says if another storm like this comes to the Mississippi Gulf Coast. We have a pretty good game plan in place for floodwaters and whatnot, and, and we're pretty much secured and prepare for any storm. Uh, we never know when you're going to have a storm pop up on the water here. So we're pretty pretty prepared. As the cleanup continues, Holloman says he hopes these clear blue skies stay for a little while. But our first alert weather team is already forecasting stormy weather on Friday. In past Christiane Parker Boyd, WLOX News Now.